All right, my favorite cards, Sapphire. I'm a big fan of Sapphire. I like the way the box looks. I like the way the cards look. I like everything, but I don't love the price point, I gotta admit. Price point's getting to be a little bit on the ridiculous side. Otherwise, I'm a big fan. One Chrome autograph, Topps Chrome, Sapphire Edition, whole bunch of popular players in the front. Um, Jason Dominguez I see there, but not Aaron Judge, but they're all... Well, they're not rookies, because you got Sohei there. Good old Shohei, uh, just a day, maybe two ago, you know, yesterday, joined 50-50, and he's catching up to Aaron Judge in home runs. I don't like that. <laughs> you know, like, I'm hoping Judge has one more little hot streak. Yes, I want him to get hot during the playoffs and not necessarily, you know, right now, but still, I don't want Shohei to be the home run leader and this, that, I don't know. I'm tired of Shohei. Although, just so everyone knows, take a look here. There's only 32 cards in this box. That's crazy. 32 cards, and I don't remember what I paid for this, but I paid a couple of bucks for this. So crazy price point. Hopefully, you know it's a lottery ticket. Maybe you get something. It'll be fun. Let's see. But uh, for Shohei, I actually went to Tops now, and I bought how many? I bought 20 of his record-breaking thing. Because there's a chance, apparently, of not just getting a base card. They 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 randomize, I guess, parallel cards. And that's what you're hoping to get. So I decided to go for 20. Um, I don't know if I'll do a giveaway. Because I don't really need 20 Shohei cards, to tell you the truth. So maybe I'll turn that into a giveaway somehow, some way. We'll, we'll turn it into something. But I'll open it up on camera and see if I get lucky and get a parallel card. So here are the packs. 32 packs. I think it's four cards in a pack. It's crazy. Just crazy. You know, really the, the parallels and the uh, the autograph is the big, big deal. You'll never get your money back on these cards. I mean, if you do, you know, one out of how many, maybe you get your money back. But it's just a fun set. I mean, I, I just love the design. It's like every card is kind of special, you know. Got the Braves who are falling apart a little bit. Rookie. Mm, some sort of color. Kyle Freeland. A one of one. Wow. Trevor. So, I don't have many one of ones. That is a one of one. Kyle Freeland. I don't know Kyle Freeland too well. <laughs> and honestly, a Rockies pitcher is probably like the worst number one of one you can, <laughs> you can ask for. But still cool. Hopefully somebody out there wants this guy. You know, got 17 wins back in 2018. How's his uh, war been doing? And earn run average, five point something. Well, okay. So I'll probably put down, if I could try and figure out what this value might possibly be, a one on one. If you're a big Kyle Freeland fan, let me know. I'll work out a deal with you. Uh, but one of one. So nice, nice start. It's always interesting to have one of ones. I only have a very small handful of one of ones. Like, I'm thinking like I have like two or something like that. So, interesting. Casey Schmidt. Hendrix. Look at that autograph. Out of 199, Yamamoto. All right, the guy that I want the Yankees to get. Rookie card, autograph. All right, well, two packs in. I got a 101 and I got a, out of 199, a Yamamoto. That's not too shabby. I don't really deserve too much more. So let's see now if we can get really greedy. And get one more good card maybe. But, uh, oh, not too bad. Not too bad at all. Uh, Tigers are doing pretty good. Floreal. He was the Yankee guy for a while there. Right? Yeah, he was on the Yankees. Never really worked out. But... Root from a little bit. Got a color card. All right. Well, here's the Ellie De La Cruz, which I'll certainly put him on here as a base card. And then we got a color out of 25 of the Tampa Bay Rays. What do we got here? Anybody special? Yeah, I mean, like, you know, the Rays. But another numbered card. So, a one of one. And I got a card out of 25. Ellie De La Cruz and Yamamoto. I'm running out of space in the stands. So, really, I guess, 
try and be really greedy and get one more good card. One, two, three, four. Got five packs left. Hopefully, everyone's having an outstanding day. Astros, no, no. So the only good thing about this card is my uh, favorite player from the Astros is not on it. So that's a good thing. So, so. Lindor, who's hurt at this moment, but he is having quite the season for the Mets. Nice looking card. Let's see what we get here. Brady Singer. Egai Rosario. <laughs> and something. Out of 50. Jordan Romano. Romano. I mean, another, you know, all, all these numbered cards I'm very appreciative of. I don't really know them too well, though. Freeland, the Rays, Jordan. But not complaining because it's another numbered card and I officially ran out of space on the stands and I still got three more packs left to go. I'd have to call this an outstanding box for me, personally. Would love to get a Aaron Judge. If there is an Aaron Judge. Jared Kelnick. This guy, I've seen like some good thing. He he does good for like a little bit and then he gets injured or has a problem or just kind of falls apart. I think he could have one or two good seasons in him. Like, you know, twenty five home runs, maybe bat like, you know, two seventy. We never really Turned into that player that everyone thought he could be. Nice hair. And here we go. Out of 50, Hunter Green. I feel like I'm getting a lot of cards. <laughs> I'm going to put them over here. Last pack. I don't think they owe me too much here. But last pack. I'd love... For Dominguez, I'd love an Aaron Judge, I'd love, uh, I guess, even a Shohei, kind of. It's a nice card. Pete Crow Armstrong. I'd call it a good card. Put him over here for now, if I can get without falling down. Max Fried. Victor, rookie card. And the last card. Curtis Mead. Rookie card from the Rays. All right. Well, I mean, the box is ridiculously priced, but for that ridiculous price, I'll go through everything one time here. I'm not sure what's worth more. Is the one of one worth the most, or is the Yamamoto signature? Let me know your guess. I'll, I'll probably actually I'm going to probably put the values of the cards up here. Um, Pete Armstrong, Pete Crow Armstrong. Out of 50. Out of 50. And base card, De La Cruz. Out of 25. One of one. Yamamoto. So, pretty cool. Pretty cool indeed. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you think I missed anything. Um, man, you know what the funny? I think I tried to... Maybe it was Bowman Sapphire. Tops had some sort of promotion where you had to go in to their website and there was a randomizer and you go in and, and then maybe you get picked, maybe you don't get picked. I tried to buy a couple of boxes and I didn't get picked. I'm not sure if it was Tops Chrome Sapphire or if it was Bowman Sapphire maybe. Now I'm not sure which one it was, but I didn't get the pick. And I looked, and they're selling the boxes for like four or five hundred dollars. You could have gotten it for like I don't know, three hundred fifty or something through the top site. The prices are getting ridiculous. That's why I've slowed down a little bit. That and some brain surgeries, and you know, whatever. It's just the way it goes. Um, but let me know how you're doing. Let me know what you think. Know what you've seen. What you want to see. All that kind of stuff. I'll talk to you later. Enjoy your day. Thanks.